What up, YouTube? Big Little Big Leaks Cars Review back in with another review, and that's right, today we're not here to do a review. Today we're actually here to pick up and, well actually it's already picked up, but today we're here to do a little V-mail, you know, I can't say the word because it's illegal now on YouTube, but we're gonna opening up a little V-mail today. And this one traveled all the way around the globe, like literally around the globe. And uh, this is from a gentleman by the, by the name of Mondo, I think it's Mondo1974, I'm pretty sure that's his name on Instagram. But um, yeah, I'm just gonna say his name's Ray. I'm not gonna get into his last name, I'm just say Ray. Now Ray's a good friend of mine, I talk to Ray often. Ray, uh, Ray's from Australia. <laughs> so he's from Australia and uh, real nice guy uh, we've been talking I think for about a year now and he's just a subscriber that initially just watches videos and uh, reached out contacted me and most subscribers that reach out and contact me I usually talk to so um, I you know when I have time and I'm able to you know reach out talk you know and just BS, that's about it really. But uh, me and Ray, we've actually grown pretty close and uh, nice guy, real nice guy and uh, really do appreciate spending time with him on the phone. Uh, it's so funny, I live in New York and I've had friends growing up my whole life. I have coworkers that I work with, but there's really no one I really hang out with except, except me and my girlfriend, you know? And I don't really communicate after work with any of my coworkers. So uh, Ray is in Australia. <laughs> and he's like the only person I really talk to, which is funny. Uh, you know, you're supposed to have all this, you know, this YouTube celebrity fame, and you're supposed to be talking to a million people all the time. and, and oh, reality I just speak with one guy and he lives in Australia and that's about it so that's actually pretty funny if you think about it uh, you know I've got acquaintances and I have friends also in a sense that you could say that I know through my girlfriend and uh, you know other people that I grew up with that are you know friendly or friends with me but nobody really close you know and Ray's been that type of guy that I just basically you know talk to whenever we're available we talk now he's 12 hours behind I think I think they're 12 hours behind New York time so when I talk to him sometimes like like the day of my birthday it was the day after when he called me and he's like yo happy birthday and I think it was he was the day before like in his time and in my time I was the day after I was like yeah it was yesterday he's like no it's today it's the 23rd I'm like Nah, dude, it's, uh, it was, you know, so it's just kind of funny, but, uh, you know, that 12 hours is 12 hours. I think it's actually more than 12 hours. I think it's like 13 or maybe even 14 hours. I don't really know, but this big old package came straight from Australia and I don't want to show his address, but you'll see in the bottom here, it says Australia. <laughs> All right, and uh, I have no idea what's in the package. He said he was sending me a surprise. I thought this was really cool of him. Uh, I have yet to send him a bunch of mechanical tube mods. Most of you know on YouTube, I really suck at mailing things out, but uh, I will eventually. And uh, I, I, you know, this is just uh, my girl actually, you know, kicked me in the ass and said, uh, you know, I think it's time that you actually, uh, you know send Ray a gift. So uh, I'll be sending Ray out something sooner or later. Uh, I'll send him a really, really cool package. But uh, all in all, I just wanna go ahead and open this up and see what came across around the world in a package. So let's see what's what. I don't wanna rip anything. I would normally use a razor blade, but since I don't know what's in this package, I'm gonna go slow. Mm. Okay, alrighty, so, ah oh, man, that's, that's kind of rough. So he got me a package and he sent me a bunch of chocolates and stuff, but I got a bag, but I have no idea what's in this bag. Uh, let's see, this is Nougat Honey Log. I got a Nougat Honey Log, so that's a candy bar there. Uh, I got another Summer Roll. This is a uh, lightly roasted peanuts and nougat rolled in milk chocolate and coconut. Another interesting little nougat thing. This says Whitaker's coconut slab, but you can see it's a little damaged. It got a little damaged in shipping. 
Chocolate's a little melted. I guess from the heat, it says coconut slab also, so that's uh, a little damaged. This here, Walter's Melon Slices. Juju's, so this is Juju's Melon Slices, but it says Walter's, and they're all literally melted together. So God knows how hot it is in Australia right now. Uh, a nougat honey log again. And what else is in here? We have another summer roll. Okay, look at that. And what else is in here? A lot of melted chocolate in there. A lot of melted chocolate. This is Chico's Chewy Chocolate Flavored Jelly Babies. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I like that. I dig that. I'm going to have one of these. I'll try one of these babies out. Okay. So in the shape of little babies. That's so funny. Wow. Mmm. It's like a chewy candy that tastes just like a jello pudding pop. Um. That's crazy. It tastes just like a jello pudding pop, but in like a chewy candy, like almost like a gummy bear. Mmm. Mmm. That is so dope. Chico's. We're gonna try a summer roll. Hmm. And a summer roll, lightly roasted peanuts and nougat, rolled in milk chocolate and coconut. Really different. Very chewy. Mm. Mm. It's like a crunchy, crispy coconut that's toasted. Super sweet. Ooh. Mm. Chocolate is good. The nougat is very sweet, very chewy, but it's got a very honey. It's a very strong honey taste. Mm. Mm. That's dope. Little, little too sweet for me on the summer roll. Little too sweet. And imagine the honey log it's probably just as sweet. This is lightly roasted peanuts and coconut in honey nougat coated milk chocolate. Mm. <laughs> I'm gonna have to hold off on that one. These, unfortunately, these exploded in the package somehow. I don't know how, but the uh, coconut slabs kind of like, you know, melted and exploded in there. So that's kind of rough. Uh, the Walters. Melon slices. This literally melted into one pool of jelly. <laughs> yeah, we'll take a look at this. Oh yeah, yeah, that's. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, that's just one big gigantic melted and combined jelly thing. I'll see if I can take a bite in there somewhere. Wow. Mm. There's like Sour Patch Kid watermelons. That's exactly what it tastes like. But really sour. Whoo. Mm. Juju's experience of fun food. Well, whoa. That is really sour. <laughs> Incredibly sour, wow. Mm. 
Wow, that, that really got me back here and right here. Oh, very sour. Now, he also gave me a V-mail bag. This is a, a V-bag. I'm gonna call it a V-bag because I can't say the word because you know on YouTube, they'll like sue you and throw you in jail. Oh, nice. This is strawberry milk, Pacific Sangha, zero MG. Still got yet to try that. That's cool, thank you, Ray. That's awesome. That's awesome. And then, let's see, ooh, we got some other stuff in here. We got Mox, strawberry dragon fruit. Hmm. 7030, 3MG. Wow, really pleasant. Really nice. Ferrum City Liquid, the quickness, simply delicious strawberry milk, 0MG. Mm. Gonna knuck it. Mm. Mm. Little heavy on the Etho Malto and the um, Bavarian cream, but it's actually pretty good. It's a nice like strawberry blonde it tastes like. Mm. That's a good tasting liquid. This is Ferrum City Liquid Cereal 11 Zero MG. Looks like a strawberry tart. That's a nice, subtle, light flavor. I'm digging it. Doesn't say where this product's from though. I'm guessing it's from Australia. Don't really know, but pretty good. And this is Ohm Shake, 6MG. Ohm Shake Strawberry. It's a pretty dark color. Ooh, at 6MG, you feel it. Mm. But a really good strawberry taste. Ohm shake. Not bad. Pretty good. So uh, this last one I'm going to give a shot. This Meta Pacific Sangha. This is from LA. So this is straight out of Los Angeles. Zero MG, but let's see. It's like a, almost tastes like white chocolate and strawberry. They say it's strawberry milk, but it tastes like a white chocolate and strawberry. Pretty good, a little different, a little different. I'm still using Homecoming from, um, Freeman Vapes, still still rocking this juice. So still enjoying that juice basically. Uh, but I am a strawberry guy, by all means. You got strawberry juice, send it my way. I love strawberry liquid, any kind of strawberry. But let me tell you, Chico's, these are dope. Mm. For real. Mm. It's literally like a gummy jello chocolate pudding pop. It's just so good. Mm. Wow. Here's your dope. Yo, Ray, you hit the nail on the head, man. This one is awesome. The other one's a little too sweet for me. <laughs> this is super sour. And, uh,. I'm almost afraid to try the uh, honey nougat because the summer roll was just super, super sweet. A little too sweet for me. But let me tell you, mm, these are awesome. You can send these anytime, bro. I'll always eat them. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah. 
Mm. For those of you people who can't stand and cringe to the sound of somebody chewing, you can't stand around somebody who's eating these things, that's for sure. Mm. Please don't thumbs down the video because this is just too good. Mm. Um. Mm. That's dope. Thank you, Mr. Mondo. Thank you, Ray. You are the man. Yo, I gotta send you something, man. I know, I know. Kick me in the ass. You're getting it. Don't worry, no worries. You got, I got you. All right? Mm. That was dope. That was so dope. Mm. I'm gonna drip a little of quickness. Mmm, that's a really nice taste in strawberry. <laughs> that's really good. Yeah, they hit it out the park with this one. This is uh, this is actually really good. I'm really surprised. So this came out good. The quickness. Good strawberry quick. They did a good job on that one. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to be enjoying these liquids, that's for sure. But I'm totally going to be enjoying... Chico's and I think I'm gonna be looking for these on Amazon or eBay if somebody's got them online These are dope mm. If you guys like chocolate like like candy chocolate or chocolate flavoring Chico's they're dope That's all I gotta say YouTube. So like comment and subscribe. I'm out of here. Peace